Hello and welcome. Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is the first official video of 2023. So I wanted to make it a good one. I'm a Canva creator. I create content for Canva. I create content for clients. I create lots of templates and elements and imagery and all sorts of stuff like that. Absolutely love design and everything around design and Canva. And that's what this YouTube channel is all about. So I'm going to show you an amazing feature that is going to be great for your business because I mainly help small business owners use and understand Canva and get it working for your business. So I'm going to head over to my screen and I'm going to show you the feature I'm on about. Okay, so here we are. This is my Canva account and I'm going to show you something you're going to really like. It's here in the docs section. So I'm going to click on docs. This is on your home page. I'm going to click on this and you're going to see this page come up. A warm welcome to Canva Docs. Now, have a look through all of this. There's a lot of information in here, but the piece I want to show you is this, the magic right feature. I love this feature. So if you want to try this, you can do. I am going to just go down to the bottom of the page to give myself a little bit of room. You can delete all of the information or, or create yourself a new, a new document. That's absolutely fine. I'm going to click on this little cross, the little cross symbol that comes up. And it's the first one here, Magic Right. OK, so what are we going to do? I'm going to put in here, I've got to tell Canva what I want it to write. So I'm going to say, write five tips on uh, creating content for a florist okay so we say we're we're a florist i want some social media content and i'm gonna see what canva comes up with so this is canva's ai version for content and it has written me five tips so take beautiful photos, create engaging information, blog posts, utilizing social media, your SEO and focusing on quality content. So this is creating tips for creating content for a florist. So I can now take these tips. I can now create five different social media posts if I want to. And I can use this information. And this works for so many different things. You will have hours of fun playing with this I'm gonna go magic right okay um right three oh we've disappeared magic right 300 words on how to become a oh trapeze artist something really random let's see what canva can bring up for that and you'll notice this is a, a tip you can use up to 200 words in your prompt so you can be extremely specific on what you want it to create for you and there we go canva has written 300 words on becoming a trapeze artist so have a read through of the content you create and then if you want to edit it, you want to change some words, you want to put it more into your tone of voice for your own content, do so. But it gives you this amazing background, this amazing step for you to create awesome content in Canva. Have a go at this because it is really good fun and I'd love to see what you create. So there we go, just a very quick video. I love my quick brief videos. I don't wanna take up too much of your time, but just on how to use the new Magic Write feature. It's a fantastic feature. There's gonna be so many different things that you can type into it, different types of content and information that you can come up with. Um, or even if you wanted to know the answer to a question, you could use it for that as well. So there we go, the Magic Write feature in Canva.